Hey gang, it's Loner. Hey, welcome back everyone. Well, we're headed in the right direction again, headed north. Pretty muddy in this area. Anybody lose a shoe? Hello, nice people. I was hoping to get to Maine today, but uh, the remnants of the hurricane are coming in today, so might not make that. But yeah, it's been nice today. Look at this. There's some climbing, but look at this. This is nice. I love this. That's pretty cool. That's the official stick sign for the whole trail. <laughs> All right, I'm going to keep trucking and uh, get back with you later, at, hopefully at the main border. So yeah, and there's the purple Bye. poncho, so to prove that I was here. You. This is the last state. It felt really good going into the last state. Making these videos, I noticed the colors had changed. Everything's gray, gloomy, misty. Uh, Maine likes to keep it wild, but there is some stairs. Look at these rebar handholds going up this rock. Mahusik Notch. I was really looking forward to this, seeing it in other videos. Um, and it's one of my favorite parts of the book, too. I would love to have another try at it. Yeah, the music notch, finishing that was a huge sense of accomplishment. Only fell three times. After that, Maine goes up and down the mountains. And it's all bare. You gotta just look for roots and tree branches to hang on to. Well, I hadn't had a phone the entire trip, but I broke down and bought one. My new girlfriend was coming to visit soon, and it was necessary, but it was also it was a pain in the butt trying to get signal. I actually have another hammock in the mail in Stratton, but I'm nowhere near Stratton. So. This next gentleman's trail name is Finch. He was a former through hiker who lives in the area who was there looking for birds, bird watching. Check out this next picture. I never posted this before because I looked so emancipated that I was afraid my mom would freak out and she would have. So I never posted it before. Keep in mind, I started the trail. I was 250 pounds. Now this next picture I think is also interesting. If you look in the middle of the screen, those tiny dots, there's 12 hikers coming up and down that mountain. Yep, some are sobo, some are nobos. I don't know this gentleman. If anyone knows, let me know. Um, that's Violet, Clock Tower in the orange, and Man Bear Pig in the red shorts. We got another register box. I see Bubblefoot's been here. You tagger. I don't know where to register, so I guess he wrote him right on the front. Which I wish they wouldn't do that. You know, that's not necessary. I met him, he's a nice guy and all, but. Whoops, almost busted my ass again. Oh, the link I always had a suspicion so. that Bubblefoot used the tag Bonkman throughout the trail, writing on every rock, shelter, fence post he could find. And I'm not sure if it is or not. But Bonkman caused me a lot of problems. I was accused twice of being the All tiger. Alright, going to town tomorrow, hopefully. And we'll see if we can figure out something else. Here's a good look at my pack. Check out the compass that Calf sent me. And uh, some windmills. A lot of those up north. And a cemetery we saw trying to get Man to Andover. That's right. I'm in the... Uh, I should be in the shelter lines. I wasn't in these last two because I slack-backed it. Yeah. yeah I guess. Andover. Pretty cool town. I like it. Where's the restaurant? 
There's the gas station and the general store with some good stuff. There's uh, the ice cream shop. And that's it. We got a fire department, a post office. In the pocket. Is there a lot of rebar stuff in here? There's not a lot. Thanks, uh, thanks, Wolfman, uh, 6,000, man. I appreciate the letter, and I appreciate the 20. Yeah, I'm here in Andover, uh, Maine. So it's fun to be in Maine. We had to walk about six miles, though, the, the road to get to town before we got a ride. I'll see you later, and uh, look for more videos. Congratulations to Buck Wild for completing his AT through right. Pick up Painted Blazes on Amazon.com or PaintedBlazes.com. Bye, guys.